On Friday, December 3rd, the basketball action continued at the Tiger Den as part of the second day of the 2021 Rio Grande shootout. Kicking things off were the Tularosa Wildcats against the Hatch Valley Bears. The Wildcats would go on to beat the Bears 62-20. The second game saw the Chaparral Lobos take on the Cobre Indians. The game started off close as the quarter saw the Indians score 13 points and the Lobos score 12. In the second quarter, the Lobos were able to take the lead, scoring 13 points and holding the Indians to 5 points. After the half, the Indians cut the lead, scoring 9 points while holding the Lobos to 4 points. The final quarter saw the Lobos play strong defense, holding the Indians to 1 point while scoring 9 of their own. The final score was 37 to 28, with the Chaparral Lobos winning. For the final game of the evening was the HSHS Tigers versus the Silver City Colts. Coming to support the Tigers were the HSHS band. As the game kicked off, the Tigers took an early lead, scoring eight points in the early minutes of the game. However, the aggressive fighting Colts took advantage of some Tiger mistakes and controlled the rest of the first quarter with the score being 8 to 17. The Colts were able to keep the aggressive pace in the second quarter, scoring 16 points and holding the Tigers to only two. After the half, the Tigers came out and were able to be more productive, scoring 11 points in the third, but the Colts were able to maintain their lead, scoring their own 15 points. The fourth saw the Colts maintain their lead for the win. The final score was 28 to 59 with the Colts winning. 21 Rio Grande Shootout. That's it for my day two coverage of the 2021 Rio Grande Shootout. Check out the links in the descriptions to see how the final day went. I am Adrian Chavez from the Sierra County Sentinel, signing off.